Welcome to Will It Work? I'm Kevin. Today we've got the uh, SpongeBob Bikini Bottom 500 from Jack Specific. It is a, uh, I think they call this an Ultimotion. Uh, it's a motion controlled racing game. Uh, you basically just hold this in your hands, you've got some buttons and you can just move it left and right, you know, back and forth, and uh, control the game that way. How well does it work? How well does it play? You know, runs on some four AA batteries. Uh, it came out in 2009. Let's find out. We'll switch over to the video side and we'll see how well it works. Here we go. Okay, we got the Jack Specific SpongeBob Motion Game. Let's see what the title is on this thing here. SpongeBob SquarePants. So 2009. So these motion ones came out later than a lot of the joystick ones. That's A to continue. Bikini Bottom 500. All right, A. Let's see. Select a save spot. Okay, I'm going to steer to the left, steer to the right. Jellyfish Fields. Looks like we got some locked ones. Let's start with the first one. Uh, let's do this. During Ultimotion events, keep a close eye on the prompts to complete the event. So it must be what they call this thing as an Ultimotion. So how do I go forward? Push the button. Yeah. Oh. oh. I mean, the motion control works all right. You know, for what it is, it probably just has some sort of accelerometer of some sort inside of it, but it could be also even a mechanical type of thing, like a ball rolling around that you can't hear, but, you know, it's moving between contacts. That's how they used to do things like this. I mean, actually, you know, this isn't, this isn't, this isn't awful. For a little kid, this isn't too bad. I mean, it plays pretty, it plays pretty decently precise. Pull. Oh, I gotta do it at a certain time. There we go. Come on! Rocket power or something here. Bullshit. I think the kids said that a lot when they were uh, playing this game. They're like, Dad, this game is bullshit. sure when it ends. Oh my god.
Ooh. I can't believe I'm in fourth. There must be like a way to turbo or something. Oh, well. So this is pretty good. I mean, for a little kid's game, like a little racing game, holds up. There's no real moving parts other than these buttons, so it's not like you're really going to break anything. Um, you know, for the time, 2009, was that like uh, 13 years ago? It's pretty good. Uh, thanks for watching.